Hey guys, right here I have a 1995 BMW 840CI And today, I'm going to make a startup and full vehicle tour video of it Show you the features, inside and out So, here is the key. Let's go ahead and start it up first. There is keyless access in this car, just that the battery for the key is not working, so I have to use the key to unlock it. The windows dip down a little bit as you open the doors to clear the door frame. And that is because the windows in this car are frameless. The E3186 series uses a hydraulically assisted recirculating ball power steering system. This 840CI is equipped with the M-Technique leather steering wheel with the M-Tricolor stitching around the inner rim and sport grips at 10 and 2. Two transmissions were offered on the 840CI. Buyers could choose either a 6-speed manual or a 5-speed automatic. The latter, which is fitted to this car, features low gear selection. Safety in the 840CI consists of two airbags, anti-lock braking system, automatic stability control plus traction, an alarm system, and an immobilizer. As usual, let's turn on the hazards, lights, front and rear fog lights, take a look at the engine, and roll down the driver's side window. Sixteen-inch turbine spoke style nine light alloy rims with two three five fifty ZR sixteen Toyo Proxas T one R tires are fitted to this eight four zero CI. The brakes are ventilated discs and solid discs, front and rear respectively. For the suspension, the front gets McPherson struts, while the back has a multi-link setup. E thirty one represents the code name given to the first generation eight series. The model debuted at the 1989 Frankfurt Motor Show, with production beginning in 1990. Despite both being coupés and the 8 series going on sale right after the production of the E24 6 series stopping, the former is not a replacement for the latter as the E31 is positioned at a higher price point with a different target market. Four production models of the E31 were available, 840CI, 850i, 850CI, and 850CSI. There were also three prototype models, 830i, 850ci Cabrio, and M8, that never reached production because of various economical reasons. As with other BMW models, Alpina tuned the E318 series as well. Two models came out of this tuning exercise, the 850i base B12 5.0 and the 850ci base B12 5.7. During its production run between February 1990 and May 1999, just under 31,000 units of the E31 8 series were built. After 19 years of absence, BMW released the all new second generation G15 8 series coupe in 2018 for the 2019 model year. Two engine options were available for the 840CI. From July 1993 to February 1996, a 4 litre V8 was in the 840CI 
And from January 1995 to May 1999, a 4.4-litre V8 was in the 840CI. So, that means for the whole 1995 year, buyers could choose either engine options if they wanted an 840CI. This 840CI is powered by the M60B40, 4-litre, dual of 8 cams, 32 valves, naturally aspirated V8 petrol engine with multipoint fuel injection. This engine produces 282 horsepower at 5800 rpm and 400 Nm of torque at 4500 rpm. 0 to 100 km per hour takes 7.4 seconds and the top speed is 250 km per hour. The fuel tank size is 90 liters and the combined fuel consumption for the 4 liter 840CI automatic is 11.4 liters per 100 km. The 8 series is a rear wheel drive vehicle. Exterior features of this 840CI include manual leveling halogen projector pop-up headlights, front and rear fog lights, indicators on the front fenders, body colored M technique side mirrors, unpainted door handles, and quad exhaust pipes. Speaker, storage, mirror controls, window controls. All four windows in this car have an automatic down function, while the front two windows are the only ones that get an automatic up function as well. Window lock. Interior brightness adjustment. And the driver's seat in this 840CI does get full powered adjustments with all of the controls located right down there. To gain access to the back, locate this lever right here, push it and flip the seat back forward. Alright, so let's go ahead and see how she revs.
control zone, automatic climate control system, fan speed, front defrost, air conditioning, recirculation, different modes and temperature for the front passenger, and different modes and temperature, but this time for the driver. Heated seats for the driver and front passenger, rear sunshade control, automatic stability control, and your driving modes, sport, economy, and winter. Ashtray or storage together with a secret lighter or a power outlet depending on what you use it for. A multi-information display. You can check your fuel consumption, range, average speed, speed limit, so on and so forth from this display. Digital clock. Rear defrost is up here, together with the headlight level adjustment lever. This 840CI comes with the BMW Business Head Unit with a CD player and 12 speakers for the sound system. The sound system that this car uses is actually quite good. It is a fairly simple head unit to use, CD player, eject, tone, volume power, different modes, radio buttons, random, FM AM, seat track, and six preset stations. Cruise control, wiper controls, and indicator controls. You can use the button at the end of the indicator stalk to go through the multi-information display as well. The steering wheel in this car adjusts telescopically only. You use it, or rather you adjust it using this lever right here. In-car telephone. Auto dimming, rear view mirror. Your interior light and reading lights. Sunroof. Sun visor for the driver's side gets a vanity mirror and a couple of lights. Alright, so that's it for the startup. We can turn it off right now. And continue with the rest of the tour. To gain access to the boot, go towards the boot lid itself, locate the touchpad beneath the BMW badge. Boot space in the 8 series is 320 litres. Under the boot floor is the vehicle's spare tyre.
window control, speaker and storage below. The front passenger seat in this 840CI does get full powered adjustments as well with all of the controls located right down there. It is the same method to gain access to the back. Pull the lever and flip the seat back forward. Lockable glove box. It is a bit small, but you do get a couple of cup holders and um, it is illuminated. Sun visor for the front passenger. Does get a vanity mirror and a light as well. And a grip handle for the front passenger right here. Alright, so let's start it up with the door closed. Alright, so that's it for the startup and full vehicle to a video of this 1995 BMW 840CI. Thanks for watching and goodbye.